Hey guys, Mixed Media Girl here. Welcome back. So yesterday I did an egg carton pour. I will definitely be doing more coming up. But this is just the bottom of the egg carton. And then I was looking at the top and I was like, why not see if we can make something cool with that? It's kind of like a tray. So I did tape off. There's two holes here for some reason. Um, also, funny fact, I never realized until yesterday that the nutrition facts were on the top. <laughs> so I'm going to go ahead and layer colors in here and kind of use it as a, a tray. And I'll explain the colors as I'm going. So I'm using, these are just Artist Loft Flow Acrylics, white and black. And I do still just have a 9 by 12 canvas. Um, I'm sure a lot of you are kind of running into this problem, but the last time I was at the store, this was all they had. So that's what I have. Um, hopefully I'll be able to get some more sizes coming up. I do have a few random like larger sizes, but in terms of the smaller canvases, this is kind of what I got. Okay, so red. Definitely got to get some of that gold in there, of course. And I don't want it to sit here too long because I, I feel like it might kind of soak into <laughs> this egg carton material. More white. And I'm loving this teal recently. Plus I mixed up a whole bunch of it. So let's go ahead and get in there with that. Now, I'm not sure how much this carton thing will hold, so I think I'm going to go ahead and just use this, and if I need to add some more around the edges, I can. I'm just kind of, this is, a, I think I already said it, but similar to the dustpan pour, so I'm just kind of dumping as I go. Either way, I'll end up with a very pretty egg carton lid. <laughs> Look how nice that is. So if you want to custom paint your egg carton lid, <laughs> there you go. All right. Just for good measure, I am going to add a little bit of white around the edges. I think I had almost enough, but probably could use a little bit more. You don't want to have to stretch too much. All right, here we go. So I did, I mean, I guess a kind of interesting part of this experiment is how I layered them in there. Um, I didn't, like I kind of layered them on top of each other not just like stripes next to each other and obviously didn't do like a tree ring or anything. So we've got some interesting patterns here and I really did not know what to expect. But there you go. All right, let's go ahead and we're going to let this sit for a little while and then we will do a close up. Okay, we're back so we did have a few little cells pop up um if you guys have heard me talk about this particular gold it is the uh, deco art extreme sheen 24 karat gold and it does tend to cause cells so but overall very simple um you know simple painting here let's go ahead and do a close-up so bottom right hand corner there are definitely some really cool aspects to this. You can kind of see the gold sitting on top of the blue there. It's pretty cool. Um, it's pretty delicate painting. I actually really like it, surprisingly. I like it more than I thought I was going to, but there you go. All right, guys. Well, there you have it. Let me know what you think. Also, this is so really, just really cool looking. I'm going to actually think of what projects I might be able to make with this. Like I could probably make it into a tray, but I'm thinking maybe even just using this as skin. So maybe like a bookmark or something 
making out of this. If you have any ideas, let me know because this looks really cool and I love to definitely have as minimal waste as possible. I'm going to get a lot of use out of this, you know, carton of eggs. <laughs> All right. And thanks for watching. I'll see y'all next time.